we go. This is an M2 Starstone Barrows using the finisher uh, and the bow. Should be pretty big DPS. We'll see if I don't get myself killed. That's basically what I'm really worried about. Is just the melee positioning. I'm used to the bow. Accustomed to using the bow, so I don't normally position myself in melee, and yeah. Oh, that was good. The all gonna kill the caster, feels like. Oh, dear. Yeah, look at like that. Just like that. Oh, those archers are on me. Actually, I think they were shooting at the tank. Drink the potion! Do I not have any potions to drink? Why did it why is it not drinking my rejuvenating potion? That's weird. Oh it did drink it. Was it on cooldown? I swear it wasn't drinking that. Back here. All right, boss time. Well, mini boss. So I'm using omnidirectional evade with the finisher in this build. That's why I'm using Evade in this and not, uh, say something else like Flurry or Fletch. Gives me a passive, effectively passive 11% damage I can use. Oh, that's on the directional Evade working? Uh, I don't know. I haven't checked. I just have it on my... This is the first time I've used it tonight, so I've been looking. But that is a good, good question. If it hasn't been working, that might, might actually be worse than something else. Died. Man, I think they got finished. Oh, that's bad. It's kind of hard to see buffs that are on you in this game. I have to be able to check that out. Like, I see buffs changing as I'm pressing evade, but I don't know if it's adding another buff or what's happening there. My guess is I should not pull the rest of those guys over there just yet, huh? I'm gonna run forward. 
Let's see if I can get this thing done. Oh, this guy's following me. Isn't that cute? such a cute little uh, security system we got here, right? Half works. Although I guess after thousands and thousands of years, this is probably the best you could expect. Don't knock me off. That guy has knocked me off that platform so many times. <laughs> The only thing that could really go wrong here, aside from those crawlers killing you, is that guy just knocking you off. just happened? Oh, wow. Uh, evidently, you're just immune to the lasers if you're charging? She should be dead. <laughs> Trying to get the artifact? Yeah, we're just running some dungeons. I'm using the uh, the uh, finisher for, like, trying it out in a dungeon. Uh, been using bows up until this point, so I'm giving the, the melee life a bit of a try. And uh, just, you know, otherwise doing content with, uh, with friends. The artifact is kind of a happy side effect. You should be dead. Oh, hey, thank you, Clutch. I'm glad you found that useful. Yeah, nice. Nice. It's good to hear that. It's my first time getting into long-form video, so I'm glad that you're finding that, that useful. Yeah, it was funny because it didn't intend... I didn't intend that to be a, a bow spear guide. It was more like a, just why do I use the weapon combos I do, and, you know, I just kind of turned into that. Whoa. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I see you. I see you. your last two mutes tonight. Yeah, I don't know what the new ones are going to be tomorrow. I'm in front of that guy. Tether me. I want the extra damage. Let's go. Let me 
many videos covering gear perks, and why is it similar to the low spear video? No, I don't. Um, that would have to be another one. I just uploaded one two days ago about how to make a build, and how to know that you're allocating your stats right. Uh, but that sounds like a good one. Like, I could, I could go over why I take the perks that I do, but if you're, like, trying to maximize damage, it might be a good idea to do that. Is there something you need? Oh, okay, got it. I'm gonna try to... Let me try to... Never mind. I was gonna try to pull the archers. Oh, god. Alright, well, I guess I'm nearly dead. <laughs> Gotta watch it because I'm gonna be really low on recovery options for a little bit. And I'm stuck in the middle of a pack of monsters. That's not good. Yeah, I feel like on M3 that would have we would have just exploded. Probably. issue is not knowing what all the perks are that are available or useful for certain builds. Sure, yeah, we can cover that. It's it's really weapon specific. I mean, there's, there's a few that are like, uh, universal. I still can't change my weapon here. I want to use the, vo the life taker for this fight, but I can't switch to it. Still can't do it. Yeah, it's, there's a lot of there's a lot of stuff that depends on like you're talking about armor perks, weapon perks, or utility versus just raw DPS. But yeah, I could try to do something like cover something like that. Oh, he's not even in melee range. Yes, tether me. Tether is so good. And he didn't even swing and I died. He didn't even get through his animation and I was just dead. going to be bow users for the rest of this fight. So I don't want to get smashed by Simon Gray again. Particularly if the animation is just so misaligned with the actual damage. You can't once you walk into that room. Alright, it's too bad. Up. Another heart rune of Bile Bomb. Most of the guys over there are from last season. Yeah, they did get rid of a bunch of perks. So I bet a lot of the current guys are like, or the guys you find out there say something like, you need to get Corrupted Bane. All that business, right?
Wow. The crystal's right here, so I can just go get that back. That one guy just before he died got that last swing in. The Retchers are like the worst part of this world. Yes, tether me. I might also do a video on the artifacts. Like which artifacts are out there and which ones you might want for different builds. So I feel like that's something you can mess up really, really easily. Don't pull aggro on it. You, you pulled aggro. You pulled aggro on the thing before the tank was done moving everything around. It's a rookie mistake. That's the ability right there, that the, the guy just used the abomination. If that boss, the abomination, uses that on you, you just instantly explode. It does like 15,000 damage. Well, if you could please tether me instead of the uh, fire mage, that'd be great. It's random, you can't do anything about it. Think sifting through YouTube videos is very time efficient. That's why I try to timestamp all my stuff. Too. It's really easy. Like one of the big things I have a hard time with is I find videos, but I need to find useful, time, timely videos, and that's not very easy to do sometimes. Somebody is outside the thing. You're dead. You're not gonna kill me with your ghosts after you're dead, boss. That's not gonna happen. The build's result uh, are based on what users like. It's a hot mess. Okay. Okay. Yeah, there's a lot of that too. Yeah. There's a lot of that. All right. Just a heads up. The everybody's pulled aggro on stuff. I'll try to keep that in mind. Thank you for the feedback. Alright, so I think we're tanking right here. Yeah, this guy's gotten smashed. I'm going to try to get him back up. It's kind of a bad time to have a DPS dead at the very beginning of the fight, you know? I dodged that, did not get it. And then the retro killed me? What killed me there? I'm not entirely sure what happened with that. It must have been the retro. I was stunned, so I couldn't use any potions. I didn't see anything targeting me, but I did die. 
crystal back there. Let's keep going. For the best, you know. Like M2s right now are the the perfect the perfect like mass consumption difficulty. You know, it's something that I can do repeatedly. Um, it's still challenging enough to keep me interested, but it's not so hard that it becomes unenjoyable. I feel like the M3s are right there at that cusp right now. You have to be very coordinated to do an M3 successfully. Raw. There he is. Got him. Yeah, we pull him up here. Just by himself. Don't stay in front of him. Sorry, I went to the wrong spot. I went to the wrong spot. It's my fault. to go back towards that pillar instead of running in the middle of the room like I did. So that makes it easier for the tank to pick it up and put it in the right position. Honestly, the, the finisher feels good, man. It feels really good. Aside from the randomly exploding, which can be solved with just, you know, standing in better spots. Okay, did somebody grab the key that knows how to skip it? Okay, so you're gonna you're pulling stuff. So, somebody needs to go consecrate the key. I don't have it. Who has it? There's four of us over here. The death. All right, that was great. Nice. Wait, do you have the key, Gecko? Who picked it up? That's that's fine. <clears throat> that's uh I feel like we're still on pace. Still get a gold with this. Five deaths. Easy. Okay, so yeah, we can just run past him. As long as we get through that door at the end of the hallway, he doesn't follow. Oh, that's why I'm exploding. I don't have my food buff on anymore. It expired. Cannot use inventory consumables while in combat. Great. Ow. 
Again, should not have been standing there. Taking a bunch of just random damage from the swings from the enemies. But it's again, I just need to get the my, my head wrapped around melee positioning. And the random movements that the uh, the melee weapons do, you know? It's like you're always shifting positions, and the enemies are always shifting positions, and the tank is shifting positions, so it's really hard to stay in one spot. Should not have committed to the other swing because I, I clicked the button one too many times and I see I'm standing on top of the tank again. It's, it's uncanny just how often that happens. <laughs> Alright, you're, you're ready for this next boss? Are you ready for the boss? Okay, well, we're pulling. Is, is a shambler coming in? Airway man, his casters. Yep, you all set. You ready for it? All right, here we go. Pulling the second boss. Here it comes. Don't let me die, please. I've already died once. I'm talking to you. I'm saying don't let me die. <laughs> have things have things aggro to me. You need to de aggro them from me. So if I go and shoot something, it's like we're playing baseball, right? The ball is the boss monster that's chasing me down. You're the catcher. If you don't catch the, the boss monster, I instantly die. It makes sense. It makes sense. Don't worry about it. The uh, evade, the evade's cooldown is just nowhere near what the actual cooldown is. 
Because I, uh, I just press it. I just press evade and it just goes sometimes, even though it says it still has four seconds left in its cooldown. Alright. Bow time. Stack up. Stack up. Stack up. This is not, this is not stacked. We're not stacked. It, you have to dodge the wave, not the impact. God. Oh, dear. Okay. Was not what I expected. Hey, room. Silver, silver. I mean, it's not gold, but it's all right. We had all we had the that team wipe, the five deaths, so that that really set us back. Plus, we missed a uh, we missed a few collectibles as well, so we weren't really I would say really aiming for gold on that one. Well, at least five gatherables on that. 